Welcome back to Boulder Cooks. My hat fell off behind the camera, so like I'm gonna have to go get that. All right, what's going on Rock Squad? Welcome back to Boulder Freaking Cooks. Today, since it's getting to spooky season, we got a Flaming Hot Cheetos bag of bones. All right, so uh, it's been a little while since I had a blueberry bagel. So you already know we got that. We got cream cheese, of course, because you can't have a bagel without cream cheese. A lot of people say that you can, and I'm like, what? But we're gonna try a Flaming Hot Cheeto blueberry bagel. I think it's gonna be nice. We're in LA somewhere where they, it's, it's like an underground place. I don't know if it's still underground. But you know, they just like toss stuff in Flaming Hot Cheetos, so I figured why not try a freaking bagel? Then I can open up a breakfast store. Baldini's Flaming Hot Cheeto Banging Breakfast. There you go. Then I can take this off and boom. Food truck. All right, so obviously we needed a toaster for this. The only outlet's over here, so I'm gonna have to cook the bagel off camera. I do apologize. I'm excited, you know, like these, this throws me back to childhood, you know, waking up, I think I was like sixth grade. I'd wake up and mom would have like a toasted cream cheese blueberry bagel ready for me a few times until I started like sleeping too much and then she spent the whole time waking me up, so. Sorry, Mom. So, uh, we got the bagel and the toaster. Now we wait. I like them a bit crispy, so it's gonna take a little bit longer than usual. I guess we can put the bagels back in the fridge. I don't know why, but like, the Monsters Inc. scene where Mike says, put that thing back where it came from or so help me, popped into my head when I said I was gonna put the bagels back in the fridge. Oh, memories. Got him. We need a knife. Right. Slap some of that cream cheese on there. You know what I'm saying? Spread that baby around like it's freaking cake. You're icing the cake. <laughs> yeah. See it? Good. Now watch this. We're gonna smash up some flaming hot Cheetos. Comment down below if you think flaming hot Cheetos are better than the original Cheetos. Because to me, I, I think original Cheetos are unmatched. Okay, like I like flaming hot Cheetos, don't get me wrong, but like nothing can be a classic Cheeto. Except for when KFC tried to put it on their chicken sandwich. That was I, I mean, they could have done better. Gotta get that fine powder. It ain't easy being cheesy. I would never. Alright, spread them around just a little bit, you know? Try to get the most even coverage as possible. I hope I can zoom in and you guys can see this because... You know, all right. That looks pretty evenly covered, if I do say so myself. Pretty spooky, but uh, there's just something missing. It's spooky, and of course, this is the best cooking show you've ever seen in your entire life. That's why we're using some Reese pumpkins today. Nothing beats a Reese pumpkin. So there it is, ladies and gents. We got the Reese pumpkins, flaming hot bag of bones, cream cheese on a blueberry bagel. Haven't eaten in about three hours. I've been drinking on kombucha, you know how it goes. But uh, let's go ahead, slap on into this. You're really gonna hate me for saying this, okay? I swear to God, this is not a joke. This isn't bad, I swear on everything. You think I'm crazy. It's basically like, a blueberry bagel. Hear me out. Okay. I'm going to try to explain this as best as possible. Blueberry bagel, cream cheese, flaming hot cheetos are kind of like a little bit like pinch of cinnamon. That's, that's just similarities. I'm not saying it tastes exactly like cinnamon because obviously it tastes like a flaming hot cheeto, but if this is like replacements in case you don't have, you know, cinnamon. And the chocolate is just like you add chocolate chips. 
I actually hate myself for thinking that this is good. This is not good. Maybe I'm just blessed. Maybe I can just turn anything disgusting into a masterpiece and it tastes amazing. Because everything I've made this past however many episodes, I'm like, that's actually pretty good. I don't understand it. Anyway, that's it for this Boulder Cooks. Hope you did enjoy. If you did, please drop a like down below. If you didn't, I'm sorry. I tried. <laughs> Other than that, keep your heads eyes, stay positive. Keep on rolling, Rock Squad. Gang, gang. Catch you guys all later. I hope you're debating which video to click right now. If you watch this point, comment flaming hot.